Coaching is teaching, so I think um, it's great uh, for your credibility to have played or played at a high, high level and what have you, but it's, it's not, not mandatory. That's, that, that probably means the boys will give you a sympathetic audience, but then it's, the coaching is really the art of communication. It's, you know, it's, um, coaching is teaching. So if, if you're a really good teacher, a good communicator, and you can, um, you can explain um, and understand that each player is different and there's three or four different ways that each player could possibly learn, and, and I think once you understand that it's not all about how much you know, but it's all about, all about how efficiently and effectively you can improve players. And I think and that's the role of the coach. It's not about the coach's career and ambitions and all the rest of it. I think it's about if you understand and you're, you're, um, the, the core reason for you doing this is to help improve other people, then I don't, don't think you'll go too far wrong. Darren, that's outstanding defence, mate. Recognising 50% rock, they had the overload, well done. Richie, straight into handling, mate, let's go. Lovely hands, Fenners, great hands, mate. Good talk, good talk, Ferg. So, uh, green team, Green team, our focus is going to be, uh, for this first block, on red zone. So understanding what we're trying to do on that red zone. Some of it's going to be offset piece and some of it will be from a chaos type situation. Just understand where we had success last weekend on that, opening up that short side. The play uh, nines and tens can organise that. Uh, defensively from the blues, it's a, it's a shoulder on. All right, so we get a shoulder on on this. Once we bed down the red zone stuff and we're happy, we'll come back and just touch on the whole, the whole nine yards. We'll go exits, attack zone, um, and we'll finish on a couple of red zones right at the death. Rugby you know, has always been my thing since I was a kid, and you know, guys like Alec Evans, inspirational coaches. Um, I, I still keep in contact with him. Um, he, was, you know, it was, he was coaching before videos and all the rest of it, and he could come into a change room after a game and go all the way around from 1 to 15 and be able to give a, a very concise summary of that player's performance. You know, it'd be, I mean, when you go for that high ball, you just need to turn your right shoulder and drive that right knee up so you can get a bit of a twist. And he was just unbelievable on, on technical detail. And as I say, I, I keep in touch with Alec to this day. And, um, you know, he, he's, a, he's a guru, a master communicator and, uh, and cared a lot about his players. And I think they're the ones you really remember.